Dies is a program for Stichting Pinkster Gemeente Suriname van de Wereldwijde Missionaris Boeke. Tan Luku en Arki de programma die Kasi Bribi Ecodoro voor Jere da Wotu Vugado. Tan Luku en Mekado bless you. Esther chapter 4 verses 7 to 11. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. If we find it, let us say amen. amen. And let us stand to give honor to the word this morning. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 I will read from a book and you can follow me in the Bible that you have. Hallelujah. I read the word in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I read the word in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Mordecai vertelde hem het hele verhaal. Hij noemde ook precies het bedrag dat Haman had beloofd aan de koninklijke schatkist te zullen schenken voor het uitmoorden van de Joden. Ook gaf hij haar dag een afschrift van het koninklijke besluit om de Joden uit te roeien. Laat dit aan Esther zien, zei hij. Leg haar uit wat er is gebeurd. Laat haar naar de koning gaan en hem om genade smeken voor haar volk. Haar dag bracht Mordecai's woord over aan Esther. Zij stuurde hem opnieuw naar Mordecai. Met de volgende boodschap. Iedereen weet dat als iemand, halleluja, man of vrouw, zonder geroepen te zien naar de koning gaat, in de binnenste voorhof, hij gedoemd is te sterven. En zei de koning hem, zijn koden schepter aangericht. Dan is zij zijn leven veilig. Het is nu al een maand geleden sinds ik bij de koning ben geroepen. Mijn collega 15, komt vers 17. Let Alleluia. us read 15 to 17. Dank u, Jezus. Toen liet Esther aan Mordechai zeggen, roep alle Joden uit Susan bij elkaar en ga voor mijn vasten. Eet of drink niet gedurende drie dagen en nachten. Mijn dienaressen en ik zullen hetzelfde doen. Daarna zal ik, ondanks het verbod, naar de koning gaan. Als ik dan moet sterven, dan zei het zo. Mordecai, halleluja, deed wat Esther hem had gevraagd. Halleluja, ik had het presie die mankte. You may be seated this morning. Dank u, Jezus. Het is al voor Abbas Koppelop, jong, die mankte. The title of the message this morning. Vertrouw naar Garo. Wie zegt je praxis dat staan in ogen boom? The title of the message is Trust in the Lord even if you think that things will not go well. Ook to if a realiteit is sorry, trust in it. Also if the reality is showing you something else. Vertrouw naar master. Trust in the Lord. En adefa nodo in a yari disi, ude inwa yu yari. It's necessary in this new year that we are in. That o meki lobiwang hallelujah abasluit fu kang vertrouw na masra. That we make the decision to trust in the Lord. Means if ye shi tak well, asan sang be ina livif mi ya mino meki. Even though you see or you say that okay, I see I will not make it with this thing in my life. Matang vertrouw na masra. But continue to trust in the Lord. Because lobi ang solis you ang vertrouw na masra. Because sometimes you want to trust the Lord. Te ushi sani ego bung. When things are going good. Te ushi takwell a fiti disi wovini. When we see that we will win the fight. 
If you see that you have a wrinkle in your situation, if you see that you are in a situation, ma in your heart you fear it tells you that you win. Uh, but in your heart it tells you that you will win. Ma te a fear it tells you that well as and this big ups are my first time. But when your feeling tells you, okay, this thing is greater than my understanding, sang you odo. What will you do? Yo ta fertro ete. You will keep trusting still. Kanera wa siki sai hori. Maybe it's a sickness that has you for a long time. Maybe a situation in your home that is going on for a long time. Um, uh, maybe in your workplace it's a situation that is more than you. And you think, okay, if I leave the job, I will get rest. Of kane in a beauty say a libi a praxeri that well as and say hor tum silanga. Or maybe in the neighborhood that you are living, you say, well, this thing is going on for too long. Da ina ka oplosing na fu froy sik moto in a beauty this. And the only solution is to move out from this neighborhood. Wat e suko yo egi fuchari yo egi rusko. Because you are looking for your own rest. And that is why this morning it's necessary to not seek to bring rest for yourself. Not to seek for your own rest. But that the Lord can bring that rest. And if God brings that rest, Others will also have joy in it. And so we see the story of Esther here. And so we see the the story of Esther here. Esther no be sabi lo biwang hallelujah. Sabo de a earth comes hallelujah. Fu a step sa awan teki. Esther didn't know what would come out of the step that she wanted to take. Engle ki kanta ki a sabi. Really, you can say she knew. Hallelujah. Because she knew that if I go in a corner, a moment in that thing. But because she knew that if she went to the king at that moment, that two sari kapsa. That two things could have happened. If I go in a long attiki king, if the king uh, stretched his scepter to her, then I can tell Libby. She would stay alive. But if I don't do that thing, but if the king didn't do that, then I did it. She would be put to death. This a fraud. This is love. Young sabi. So this woman knew. And Mordecai is the first sabi to. Mordecai also knew. Ma ushi lo biwang hallelujah that wa problem pete. But we see that there was a problem. Sabo eis a libi for the Yoda. That would cause the life of the Jews. And a mofo mekiba. And the the decision had already been made. Wang money pay. Money had been paid. For the karui den. Yoda love you and Hallelujah in a tendency for them to kill out all the Jews in that time. Hallelujah, but love you and Hallelujah. Mordecai sabi tak well what Sani must do. So Mordecai knew that something had to be done. Fuka stop Hallelujah a situasi disi to stop the situation. Because it was a discipline they both for efforts done. Because this situation was uh, above his understanding. And nobody may help the Yoda. He couldn't help the Jews. This man once Jew been there, love you, Hallelujah, in a coning also. But there was one Jew in the king's house. And I been there a coning in. And that was the queen. And a man is a probiri fu can psa atori na Hallelujah, a Hallelujah, a fraud is he. And this man um tried to explain the situation to this woman. And and then Esther. The queen's name was Esther. And so she loved you and that Aseni Boskopu ki Esther. And he sent a message to Esther. Na all the details for a situation. With all the details of the situation. I don't keep it not again. He didn't hide anything from her. Because I wanted that Asabi sang epsa no no. Because he wanted Esther to know what was happening now. And if we change in our kong. And if uh, a change couldn't come, then a fall 
Then the Jewish nation would not exist anymore. And Esther kisi aboskopu. And Esther received the message. Ma Esther praxiri abra el libi ira Esther estasi. But in the first instant, Esther thought about her own life. Because I don't want to die. Because she didn't want to die. Dus je schil op jong dat als je wat boskop op bagagi Mordecai. So she sent back a message to Mordecai. Dat je zelf voor asande. That you know how the things are. Eigenlijk no one can go in a corner if I don't say carry. No one can approach the king if he the king didn't call them. And if he go, I can't take it there. And if you do go, you can die. And I was called to Mordecai back. And the the message went back to Mordecai. And love you all with shit that Mordecai no tan tiri taku ya mo berus misrefi in sang Esther taki. And Mordecai didn't say, "Okay, I will accept what Esther said." Ma asin watra boskopu ye. But he sent another message to her. And a boskopu sa asin i love you all. And the message that he sent. Opo a ay love you all fu Esther. Open Esther's eyes. And a different no do love you all. And it is necessary, beloved. That we have believed one that we see in a year in this year. That we have believers at our side in this year. So can help we open we eyes. That can help open our eyes. And God gave us a herder. And God gave us a shepherd. And a herder that a four can help you. And the the shepherd is the pastor. And we say, beloved, one that a chari a clean word to give you. And we know that he brings a clear word to us. And if we take the word to say a chari give you. And if we take the word that he brings to us. And if we throw the master. And we trust in the Lord. Who can do sang a action we would do. To do what he asks us to do. That what they were seeing it now. Then we will be a blessing to others. Because we she love you and Esther. Because we see Esther. A moment is a kiss a boskopu fu alleluia Mordecai. The moment that she received the message from Mordecai. E ai kon opo. Her eyes were open. That an ego om a libi fu e wa. That it is not only about her life. Ai go om a libi fu de brada na gare si safi. But it's about the lives of her brothers and sisters. And if I don't make you one step. And if she doesn't take a step. I love you all, alleluia. Our last brother, our last sister, my estrefi libi can last it all. She can can lose her brothers and her sisters, but also her life can be lost. Because estrefi they were Jew. Because she herself was a Jew. This I forget it. The sun is a day in a calling in also. The blessings that they in also for a calling in. The blessings that were in the queen's house. I for forget it. She had to forget them. Afu praxiri ing brada na nga esisa. She had to think about her brothers and her sisters. But that ibega cost her life. But that could have cost her life. Malobi wang afro di si duwa belangre sani. But this woman did something very important. That a sini wang boskopu ki Mordecai. She sent a message to Mordecai. Tak ar ki Mordecai. That listen Mordecai. Fu dri di langa imtegi mi brada mi sisa mek dengori. Faster than I'm three naughty, then I'm ya naughty. She said, "Tell my brothers and sisters that for three days they must fast; they must not eat or drink anything." And me na ga de vro ko manfi usrefi o faster and begi suko kado fesi. And me, myself, and my workers, we will fast and seek the face of the Lord. Then baka dati baka three day me onko in a koni. And after the three days, three days, I will go to meet the king. And if mim dede, dang adetak mim dede. And if I should die, I'll let it be so. Hallelujah. You see, as much as they want to be a libi, you see the person that wanted to save her life. Don't want to want to love you. Hallelujah. So God will put it in. Hallelujah. One month in ati. Um, through a word that God put in uh, one of His servants' hearts. A prati lobi wang hallelujah na asisa disi. He shared with this woman. E ai opo. Her eyes were open. E lobi wang a fasi fa abe praxiri. And the way that she was thinking. A libena baka. She left that behind. Ma praxiri lobi wang hallelujah that the brother thing musti na libi. 
But she uh, uh, had the thought now that her brothers must stay alive. And sang Lubion, hallelujah, but mudak me in a pistori this year. And what encouraged me in this story that Aksabi tak omusuku gado fes. That she knew that we need to seek the face of the Lord. In a moon this Lubion, ude, it was fast a moon. In this month, we are in fasting. And maybe many people didn't take the time to fast. But it's important and when some uh, word comes out of the shepherd's mouth that you can take hallelujah and do sang a oxy for do that you can take it and do what he asks you to do. Mordecai no taigi as the imus faster. Mordecai didn't tell Esther that she needed to fast. But Esther knew that the situation that they were in was bigger than their understanding. And I just cannot get up like that and go to the king. We need to trust in the Lord. And this morning maybe you have come here in the house of the Lord. With an expectation to hear a message from the Lord. Hallelujah. The only message this morning is to trust in the Lord. Because God is asking us to take this message to others. This massa a poti in your path. The people that He has put in your way. You will take the message. Of your kibri you egi libi. Or will you save your own life? Because it's not only about you. Then, you, know, no problem. you don't have any problem. But if God is asking you. And God cares about the others that do not know him. The say you must do. What you need to do? You must move to in a comfort zone, as I said. You must come out of your comfort zone that you are in. And tell it to our Abraham and Yusuf. And tell others the good news. Because she took Esther do some Mordecai acts. Because Esther did what Mordecai asked her to do. Ma ano doing sundro fu a fasting ang abigi. But she didn't do it without the fasting and the prayer. And lo biwang if you are Abraham and Yusuf, can the Friday or take you? And if you want to take the good news, maybe fear will take you over. Can it will take you? Maybe doubt will take over. But I want to tell you that by fasting and prayer, you broke the barrier that you will break through those barriers. So that what door open. So that a door can be opened. And you can take the good news. O she lo biwang door that a faster and biggy. We see that through the fasting and prayer. And I go meet the king. She went to meet the king. And a king lo biwang langa atiki fengin. And the king uh, stretched forth his scepter unto her. And a king a king tayo dagluku alasang sa iaksi mi mi okiyo. And the king told her everything that you ask me, I will give you. Sa iwan eh. What do you want? And she lo biwang hallelujah. Takuno taka chara hair for her. But we see that the step that this woman took. That lobiwang abafrey a fola from Masra. She delivered the people of God. If mina you lobiwang make you a step, doro that uli arki tak unfasta nga begi. And if you and I take a step because we have listened that we need to fast and pray. And we have teri des ma abra abu yusu. And we tell the people the good news. Lobiwang wo she hallelujah tak. We will see that things will change. That trasma okis libi. That others will receive life. And the boom for no do lobion. It is really important. And the fraud is no be sabi from the for a fa sabob salagai. The woman didn't know from before what would be her fate. Because there were two things: either she could have died or she could have remained alive. But her mouth said, uh, uh, "She doesn't have problem to live or to die." 
Hallelujah. Ma augumiti a koni. But she will go and meet the king. Hallelujah. Is she fasting and a big lobby on a decrocti? You see, fasting and praying gives strength. For can do a worry for master son of Fred. To do the will of God without fear. And if two tori lobby on so what taki the the mountain. And two things we want to speak about today. Na a tori lobby on hallelujah for a coning for Nineveh. Ah, the story of the king of Nineveh. And lobby on a verhaal this we find in a book of Jonah chapter three. And the story we find in the book of Jonah chapter three. And lobby on hallelujah we see from the first six hallelujah go meet the first ten. We see verses six to verses ten. That according to Nineveh lobby on kiss one boskopo. That the king of Nineveh received a message. And an obey the word of the boskopo. It was not a pleasant message. Hallelujah. A boskopo ben de lobby on hallelujah that ben a fear to enter cure God of a nita a kondre hallelujah Nineveh. The message was that in 24 hours God would destroy the city of Nineveh. God wanted to destroy that city because the people were living evil. They were ugly. They were evil. Hallelujah. And I don't love you on God over but slowed for God for Nineveh a kondre this. And that is why God uh, decided to destroy this city. And Lobby on Hallelujah, usa ba hear for hand that Jonah be one go kibri Hallelujah. Lobby on for no go do Hallelujah. Aboskopus and Gado senefado. And we know the whole story how no no um Jonah went and hide. He didn't want to take the message of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And when she lobby on that talk Hallelujah, Gado Hallelujah. Doing it among this and a char aboskopugo. We see that still God forced this man, and He took the message. And love you, a moment is a a boskopo miti a koning hallelujah for Nineveh. The moment the message came to the king of Nineveh, love you, a no wakti a folag. He didn't wait on his on the people. Bible book will hear what a big saka is ready. The Bible tells us that he started to humble himself. Hallelujah, weary rogue. Crossy. And put on um morning clothes. And maybe book later will be on that a sini hallelujah one bus copu in a here condre hallelujah be aitiri. And the Bible says he sent a message to the whole city where he was ruling. Tak mek ala libis ma mus ma fasta en begi en for neiders this trefi na garo fesi. That every living person must fast and pray and humble themselves before God. And love you, my amen. This is no better seeker. Some of us they will fast and pray. This man wasn't sure what would happen if they would fast and pray. And that no one met in no one forum was dreamy of young ones. He says, not even the animals or the birds must eat or drink. And make them dry, livid, and ugly, so they will do. And let us turn, uh, let them turn away from the evil that they are doing. Love you, if we take moment to fast, the master. Beloved, if we take moments to fast before the Lord. A fiti fuka luko on the suku we strefi. It's good that we check ourselves. And if we sabi that we be horu strefi na ngasari sa no be bong ina ay fu master ina yari sa bepsa. And if we know that we were doing things that were not right in the sight of God in the year that is past. Make we leave them. Let us leave them. Hallelujah. She didn't smell this in love, young. Hallelujah! But kiss a obdrak for a fast begi suku master fesi. These people received the the commandment to fast and pray. And love, young. Oh, to love, young. Hallelujah! They been living an ugly life. Also, they needed to leave their wicked lifestyle. And love, young. A moment, hallelujah. Sankado konshita den dry den libi den libi den ugly life den. The moment that God saw that they turn around their lives and they left their wickedness, God will try a plan for them. God uh, reverses His plan. God will shift them faster. 
God saw that they fasted. God saw that they um, sought his face. That they were sorry for their sins. But important in the story is that they did not hold on to their sins. And the moment that God saw that they um, separated from their sins and their wicked lifestyle, God changed his mind. And God didn't carry out the punishment that he wanted to carry out in this city. So it is necessary, beloved, that you and I need to know that we cannot continue in our evil lifestyle. But God wants us to live a holy life. If a folk lobby on Hallelujah been faster no more. If the people had only fasted and they don't been dry they libi and they didn't turn around their lives. God of a fool a plan for earth. God would have um still carry out his punishment. Ma we she ya tak lobby on a moment is a God of she tak den enig na ga de takru libi fi. But the moment that God saw that they ended their wicked lifestyle. God changed his mind. Hallelujah. And I love you on God or do all to in your Libby if we take a okasi for can Libby then Libby sanobong in a eye for God. And that also God will do in your life if we leave the things that are not right in his sight. My love you on what sign is a machine love you on all to in a for how this is. But something else that I saw in this story that in a libi for Jonah. That in the life of Jonah. Jonah want go keep it. Jonah wanted to go and hide. So that God will be a fornitic. Hallelujah. A folk for Nineveh. So God. So that God could destroy the people of Nineveh. And can he can take it direct. Because it's my being ugly. And maybe you can say. Okay he's right. Because and the people were evil. And this God will not be going to be a fornitic. A fornitic. Hallelujah, a photo this. Otherwise, God would have never come up with the thought to destroy them. Malobiwang we she all to Hallelujah. But we also see that Jonah be abtrobi nga esrefi. But Jonah had problems with himself. Because Lobiwang we sabi that kado ben abi fu sorgo that the poor Jonah fu abodo throwe Hallelujah inase. God had to make sure that he took Jonah out from the boat and. Threw him in the sea. And lo biwan hallelujah, o fisi ben kosuari. And a fish came to swallow him. Ma ina fisi ben. But in the fish belly. A man fisi ben luku esrefi. The this man he looked at himself. Bika ano be wan tede. Because he didn't want to die. Ma lo biwan go hallelujah, lo biwan na nini fei fu chara boskopu. But he didn't want to go to Nineveh to take the message. So that God would be a red this man for Nineveh. So God could have saved those people. Ma be abtrobi na egi libi. But he was only worrying about his own life. And so ye shil ok to love you that so lazy una abtrobi na tras ma libi. And so we see sometimes we don't care about other people's lives. Ma ude busy na ga egi libi. But we are busy with our own life. Me want tell you love you the month. I want to tell you this morning that. God asks you to go for conduct and evangelize. That God asks you to um, preach His good news. And in half work today, Hallelujah, they can talk well. We go evangelize here today for you. And you don't have to wait until they say, "Okay, this and this day we will go and evangelize." In a busy place, he pay you a living. In the area where you are living, you can tell it small about Jesus. You can tell people about Jesus. Ma all to a living if you can make. But also that people can see through your life that you are a child of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. That's why she loves you. Hallelujah. In a story, this is. So we see in the story that according to Nineveh, no best service of Salangari. 
that a king of Nineveh didn't know what would happen to them. Maar Lobion vertrouwen. But he trusted. En dat dacht hij wel met u vast en aan een begi. And he said, well, let us fast and pray. En met u broko en aan een ogrisa obedu. And let us separate from the evil that we were doing. Because maybe God will be gracious unto us. He didn't know if God would have done that. But we see that the moment that God saw what they did. God changed his mind. And I want to do that too. And I want to do that again you today. And he wants to do the same for you today. We see also in Jonah and Levi. We see also in the life of Jonah. In a fish bare. In the belly of the fish. Oh, thanks of you, Hallelujah. A faith, Hallelujah. That Jonah, Hallelujah. Love you, Hallelujah. Bend the echo vestes. Despite of the fact that um, Jonah was um, only thinking about himself. That be look who is there, you want. He was only looking at himself. Hallelujah. He still didn't know what would happen to him in the belly of the fish. But he made a promise to God. Hallelujah. To do a wonderful master. To do the will of God. And love you, God. So good that the fish is charred and go poor on a sea sea. And God made sure that the um, fish went and spit him out at the shore. We were sorry, love you, the monkey that if you know suffer as you do, as if you are in a tomorrow. I want to show you that if you don't know how your situation will end tomorrow. Doch ik kan dan vertrouw na master. Still, you can keep trusting in the Lord. Om dat kan ook niet change. Because God doesn't change. Hallelujah. If I be doing ki yo na este. If he did it for Jonah yesterday. If I be doing it Esther yesterday. If he did it for Esther yesterday. If I be doing love you and give for the for Nineveh. If he could have done it for the people of Nineveh. I can do it for you today. He can do it for you today. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But so easy love you and God only do something like for Owani. But sometimes God doesn't do things the way we want Him to do it. Because so easy love you and as it was, it can be in your living. Because sometimes the situation can be in your life. And she does well, me no making. And you see, okay, well, I will not make it. Hallelujah. We got only come down to one trap of losing. But God comes with another solution. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My talk love you and I defend no do for king na ano for master. But still, it is important that we give it into the hands of the Lord. Me ko loko love you and ina boku for two Corinthians house chain. Let us look in the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 1. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Verse 8, hallelujah, to them at verse 10. Verse 8 to 10. Thank you, Jesus. Brothers and sisters, I will that you read what we in Asia allemaal hebben doorgemaakt. We zijn er bijna onder door gegaan en waren bang het niet te overleven. We hadden het gevoel ten dode opgeschreven te zijn en konden er zelf niets tegen doen. Maar dat was goed, want toen hebben wij alles aan God overgegeven. Alleen Hij kon ons nog redden. Hij die zelf doden leven maakt. Hij heeft ons inderdaad geholpen. En ons leven gered. Ja, wij weten zeker dat Hij dat telkens weer zal doen. Halleluja. We zien op jong Paulus een dag naar een gemeente. Halleluja voor Korinthe. We zien dat Paul was speaking to the church of Corinth. En dan gaat mij wat met u sabi sab salaga o in a kondre Asia. He says, I want you to know what happened to us in Asia. And so I take you to your Hallelujah. That they should take the no bomb making. And here they did. They saw that they wouldn't make it. They were afraid to take the no bomb living more. They were afraid that they would die. And that was something to your Hallelujah. So it takes livisma. And that is something that takes over um human beings. When you are confronted with situations that are bigger than your understanding, if a sickness takes you and it remains very long, 
Then you will start to think, okay, I will not make it anymore. Or someone is after your life and that person is busy with you, they do not want to leave you alone. And they are making every effort to end your life. And then you see, okay, I will not make it. And maybe uh, you go to work. And you go to work. And your boss tells you, okay, we cannot use you anymore. And you go to look for a job somewhere else, but you cannot find. And you say, okay, well, I, I will live it. How will I live? And Paul is lobbying by Abi Asim Firia. And Paul had the same feeling here. Because of the situation that they were in. The Bible didn't show us exactly what the situation was. But if we see how it explained in this, it's explained in the part here. They had a big, big problem. And they came to the place where they said, okay, we will not live anymore. Hallelujah. And what's also important in this story that they saw that they couldn't do anything out of themselves to save them out of the situation. But Paul knew that they knew someone in whose hand they could put the situation. So even though they were so afraid, even though they were wavering, but still they knew that there was someone in whose hand they could have put the situation. And this person was able to bring a breakthrough. But as human beings, they didn't think about living anymore. And love you on Paulus Taki Tak a bong tak o poting in a ano for master. And Paul said it is good that we put it in the hands of the Lord. She day for throw the master. You see, when you trust in the Lord, you will not seek to do things yourself. You will not try to bring the solution yourself. Um, when you see you cannot do it. But you need to know that you have a greater one that is looking over you. The one that has all the power. The one that has all the, the, the strength. The one that has all the knowledge. And that is the God of all gods. And you and I are on this earth. But God is sitting on his throne in heaven. And if God said he will do something. No one can 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 stop that. And they put this in the hands of the Lord. And they put this thing in the hands of the Lord. And uh, Paul said, Lord, bring us a, a breakthrough. God saved them. Hallelujah. Pull, uh, took them out of the hands of death. Because he said, this God raises up the dead. And he said, truly he helped us. And he said, truly he helped us. And he gave us life back. And Paul said, I know that he will continue to do it. So 
So this morning I want to tell you that God will continue to do it. Dus het doe in Paulus lief. He did it in the life of Paul. And how well Paulus loved you and was strong man for God. And even though Paul was a strong man of God. Ik ga ook zo love you so wonder dat het teken God will do in that and for Masra. Um, because we know the the signs and wonders that God did through him. We know the way that God used Paul in a mighty way. But still fear took him. And this morning fear can take us over. But fear must take us over so much that we forget our God. Love you and be afraid to come. Let the fear come. But thank for throw the master. But keep trusting in the Lord. Hallelujah. Because the Bible teaches us that He will continue to do it. So do it for you today. And He will still do it for you today. Amen. That's why she talk. Ongeacht, love you and that Paul is hallelujah. No be sabi for a kebafe bode. So even though Paul didn't know what would be the outcome in Asia, in Asia, took a take a situation and put it in the hands of Master. Still, he took the situation and put it in the hands of the Lord. And God, oh, shall lose you. And God brought a deliverance. She love you in a year. It is if you will make in Libya, love you. Hallelujah. Now that a throw that for throw that motto in you at it. That a throw love you and say you abi must motto in you ati. A throw say you abi. The trust must motto in you ati, in you ati. Amen. Okay, the trust that you have need to come out of your heart. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. This love you make you live in a throw. Hallelujah. Na master. So let us live trusting in the Lord. Because if we do that, he love you all. So it, because if we do that, I know make you call ashamed. We will not be ashamed. I mean, there's some sort of situation he did not in the month. And I don't know what situation you are in this morning. There's some sort of problem he did not in the month. I don't know what prob a situation you are in. If he did not seek the mountain, and if you are with a sickness, and it's not well make you weary. And you say, okay, I am tired. You want to tell you the month make you feel strong. I want to tell you this morning to trust. If you say, love you, hallelujah, and have financial problem the month. If you are this morning in financial problem. And you say it that well, you want give up. And you think, okay, I want to give up. Love you, me tell you make you go hurry go tomorrow. I want to tell you continue. If that you rock up, love you, hallelujah, you stone in a situation. If it's in your workplace, you are confronted with situation. And you want to leave the job. Love you, me tell you make you go hurry go tomorrow. I want to tell you keep holding on. Love you, if that you also that you man of that you throw you stone in a problem. If it's your husband or wife, you are having the problems with. Me want tell you make you no lose you, me hurry go tomorrow. Don't lose, but keep holding on. If that the chief you love you, hallelujah, they all go hold some. If it's your children that are disobedient, no love you and give Abraham a holy go toro. Don't give up, but continue to hold on. If you have situations, you love you and hallelujah that in your family. If you have situations in your family, thank and holy go toro. Stay and keep holding on. You want to tell you that Bible, but you learn to talk out thank to and keep it. The Bible teaches us that He will continue to do it. And I be so problem. And it doesn't matter what situation. But let us know that Jesus is the solution. But let us know that Jesus is the solution. So the only thing we need to do. Make us put our trust in. Let us put our trust in Him. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Love you and enough. Sabi for a situation ainda. You don't need to know how the situation will end. Amen. Do it, Gideon. Hallelujah. Was a ukarna fisi. He did it for the ones that we spoke about before. And I will do it for you today, Ete. And he will still do it for you today. Because God almost gives you glory. Because God will needs to get the glory. Because God almost gives you praise. God needs to get the praise. Because God almost gives you grand thanks. God needs to get the thanks. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Love you and sabi that God will have all of us under control. And know that God has everything under control. And I live with you there in a hand of Master. And your life is in the hands of God. All of us that God will do in your life. Everything that God does in your life. I do and love you and for your best well. A He does it for your good. I do and love you. Hallelujah! I do and love you and so that I can work up on you. He does it to work it out for your good. Hallelujah! I love you and I love you and for your good. 
so lisi ano de ano sa lek a a wani a feel a hungry for we live is man uh sometimes it will not happen the way we want it and we desire malobiwang au tuen lek sambung ina ai fu en street but he will do it um according to what is good in his eyes and usabi as it was if paul as lobiwang and we know the situation of paul that paul was being stoned in a city was that paul was uh, in a situation and paul was in philobia no be sabi akaba and he he himself didn't know the outcome because lobio ushita fu drili si paul was begina garo because we see three times paul prayed to the lord and lobio hallelujah Ushita gado no pur asitiwasi. And we see that God didn't take away that situation. This a kang lo biyong dako asitiwasi de in you libi. So it can be that there is a situation in your life. Malo biyong gado wan lib asitiwasi so that he can libi ng asitiwasi de. But God wants to let that situation stay there that you you will live with it. Because ushita atagi Paul es lo biyong. Because we see that he told Paul. That a kanada fi furo na biyong. That my grace is sufficient for you. Hallelujah. And back at that, he loved you. And Paul was conscious and he trafas. And after that, Paul came to see things differently. Hallelujah. Because when she loved you, Hallelujah. That as Paul did that thing, he swaki. Yes, Hallelujah. Loved you and he trafa. And because the same Paul says, when I am weak, I am strong. Because loved you when she, Hallelujah. That Hallelujah. A fit is a bed in a libi for Paulus, but we see the God of a breaking machter. Because we see there was this battle in the life of Paul, but God continued to use him in a mighty way. This can also lead to love on God. We charge Hallelujah. We try to oppose him. Ah, sometimes God wants to bring another solution. But that make you love on a little for can pour you for throw the master. But that this doesn't give you a right to take out your trust from God. Make what I have to throw in the master. Let us keep trusting in the Lord. Because God all take boom. Because God is always good. Love you and no give up, bra. Don't give up, beloved. Hallelujah. This for you a bit more love. Oh, um, even though you have it so difficult. A uplosting few then a pass the echo. Your solution is on the way coming. No one see the one see big it too much. See a car or something. There is no situation too big for the God that we are serving. And make us thank for throw na ing love you. And let us keep trusting in Him. Because God oh boom. Because God is good. God oh they want boom God oh. God is a good God. And I want to thank you the mountain. And He wants to do it for you. I want to thank you the mountain. He wants to do it for you. Thank you and throw ang na you see the God oh thank you all to the mountain. Tell someone at your side that God will also do it for you this morning. Hallelujah! I want to do it for you. He will continue to do it because for you. Because I know I need change. Because He doesn't change. A tang de caro. He remains God. And a tang de you caro too. He remains your God. For look over you and keep you. To look over you and to keep you. May God bless you this morning. May God bless you this morning. Hallelujah.